Hello and welcome back to another episode of Absolute Immersive with Lady Random, Viking Gaming, and Dariana. Hey, okay. Um, I was a little bit busy this week. More busy than anyone. Oh, well, <laughs> I just, I came over here and um, I want to clear out an area for uh, the train yard or the train shop or whatever it's called. <laughs> it's and right. I, yeah, I kind of flattened this area out yeah. to got that little mountain that was there. I'd say a, a decent area, that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I I know that the train shop's going to be kind of big because the machines are kind of huge. So um, I just kind of gave us a big area. I don't know if we're wanting to put... Because um, one of the things that we could do is... Uh, a, a What's it called? The turntable or... Uh, yeah, actually, the turntable is a... Roundhouse or whatever. Yeah, the turntables are pretty pretty big, aren't they? But we can have like a like a, maybe an engine shop i.e building them and yeah, a, okay. a loco shed or something couldn't we yeah yeah so uh we'll figure that out uh this is probably something lr and i are going to work on today yeah and then um, all me and Dari's done is built a wall for the uh we're gonna build a village well you built it i didn't do anything well yeah we're gonna be building a village for some villagers we're gonna yeah kidnap so <laughs> No, bring willingly. Well, we don't kidnap. We bring willingly. Well, at least we got the wand thing that makes it easier to move them. <laughs> yep. Yeah. It's not like you have to put them in mine carts or boats or anything oh. like that. That's no. So we, we found out you can make obsidian boats. Oh, really? Yeah, so, you'll see one as you go into that. Oh, my goodness. With two lizards in it, but... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they decided they wanted to have a uh -huh. ride. So that's in, that's interesting, it's, isn't it? Can can we do anything exciting or different with obsidian boats? I was thinking it should go in lava. That's what I think too. <gasps> so you're playing around with the factory blocks. Yeah, yeah cause the village we want to make is going to be hopefully like a steampunky style. Okay, we do have um, what is what's the other one called um laboratory blocks in this too so oh, yeah they look good i am liking this red rock cobblestone isn't yeah. it nice yeah that's beautiful <laughs> i like that i like make, that. Uh, blue like as that. well maybe maybe we could do that for the, the engine shed you're thinking exactly what i'm thinking and then maybe and then a blue slate roof or something oh, maybe oh yes that's not the blue you can use Oh, well, that's nice too, isn't it? But yeah, blue slate roof and uh, red rock cobblestone. Yeah. Oh, there's, <laughs> also, there's also the green slate too, might look mm. good. Mm. I think where it is on the kind of sort of like the red sand, I think that would look yeah, yeah. fitting. All right, so that's that. Um, I did figure out the issue. We were having some issues with the... Uh, uh, <sighs> the diesel generator mm. yeah um what was happening was even though we had the chimney in there it was still polluting out the other sides okay. and the pollution knocked down the wires oh so Dave and wonky now have eyes on that bottoms yeah i saw that <laughs> <laughs> I see. so so what I did was I, I put three chimneys on each end and then surrounded it with some chiseled glass. And then above the middle, I just put the vents and a pump. Right. It seems to be doing so, the trick, doesn't it? I think so. Right. Yeah, it contains all the pollution in there. Because, yeah, the, the pollution blocks were going up and hitting the wires and knocking them down. Yeah, I've just been leaving it off because this this thing goes through our diesel fuel so fast. Rather loud. The good news is, yeah, the tank's full of diesel so, again, and I'm not going to touch it. <laughs> yes, mm -hmm. stay away mm -hmm. from the tank of diesel. Where you're Banned at. from touching okay. diesel. And then I put some um, ladders on the side of the I building. I like so that. Know. That makes now, sense. Now be careful. 
when you come up here, be careful because the areas where the wires are at underneath, since this is a half slab, you can get electrocuted through the roof. Wow. Oh, on the, on the roof? Yeah, I think it's like in here. One of these is, is, it might not be hooked up right now because the diesel's not running, but. Well, I'm staying away from that because. Yeah. So I just, I made uh, <laughs> diamond filters for everything and I just put them on top of the chimneys, on top of the pump. So yeah. this middle, this middle one's down to power level eight. Everything else is at 15. And those two up there, I don't even know if that chimney's working or not. But, uh, but just in case. <laughs> yeah. 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 Well, I can always and then I, there's extras. They're, they're cheap to make, so. But it's always if we decide oh. to extend this up or anything, then. Right, right. Or floor. if one of these turns yellow, then you just grab a, a fresh one out of the chest down yeah. there, replace it, and then clean out the other one. But yeah, yeah. I'm, I am loving, loving the ladders. Ouch. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. And I've just been doing a lot of mining. And then I made yeah. the um, external heater here. And I'm How does this work? What, what does this do? This um, replaces the coal. So let, let me just show you me some sand or something. So yeah, it's electric, it's electric power, but it put, right. uh, output heat on. I think it's right. it two so or three Right, so I think we could it? do like up to four or five furnaces mm. off of that. You'd have to have, wow. have one side. You'd probably put the power in the top and just wrap the furnaces around it. But yeah, if I just throw this logs in here. It cool. works without coal, yeah, and it does not produce pollution either. Yeah, so. I think they're, they're kind of cool. And they've got a nice animation, the fact that they they glow up as well when they're... Um... Right. And I, so I've been doing charcoal because um, uh, I've been making steel, and the blast furnace will use either coal coke or, or uh, charcoal. That's so much easier. Although it takes charcoal. four pieces of charcoal for one piece of steel versus one coal coat. The problem is, is the um, we're filled with uh, okay. creosote, and we can't uh, make more coal coat. Although we're going to be using a lot of creosote. Yes, we are. Because all the rail ties are are made from uh, treated, treated wood, wood, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, we wanted we wanted to do some treated wood for maybe some of our build over there. So. Okay, so yeah, we got you know five hundred twelve blocks there plus whatever's in here, twelve more um, <laughs> pockets. You know, I think we should have enough there, don't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, for a always, while. We can always put stuff in to cook it for you more. Yeah, and I did I did um, make some steel plates so we could upgrade the blast furnace to the uh, the next tier. The one that takes the external heaters and and then you can actually pump stuff in and out. That could be cool. You can do that. And and because uh, I was thinking about that with the other project that um, I don't want to mention too much about here <laughs> that I sent the video on. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that might be a uh, way for us to kind of automate steel process. Yeah. So, be. Yeah. Anyways, that's that's all I've done this week, and just a lot of mining. <laughs> just a lot of mining. Well, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna upgrade my uh, my drill because I believe you've all upgraded yours, haven't you? Yes, I did. So... Mine's the kind of like this crystal shader thing on it. I love it. Although it... I, mine's like a clockwork. Mine. Yeah, it's kind of cool looking. That hard, looks yeah. very cool. That looks very steampunky, doesn't it? Yeah. Right. So, do I just need to put it into into yeah. there and then put the org augments in there. Now you should get an uh, an achievement. Me and Darwin did. Yeah, I didn't. <laughs> Ooh, so what are all these? Yeah, so you got you got a lubrication thing in there as well. There's a lubricate. There's a, a large tank and a yeah. lubrication system. Yeah, put them back in as well. I didn't get those. Um... They didn't show up in there. Right, so that's probably why the shader didn't shade bag didn't work. So if you take that out now, maybe. I don't think I've actually yeah, done anything with it. Put you put more in there. 
So if you take the drill out, did you get an achievement? Uh, no. I've just I've taken the mic. the The drill head came out. Oh no! No, put the drill head back in. Yeah. And then on the left, just take the whole drill out. Ah, right. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, go. I've got a shader. A shader. So did bag. you not have the? Um, yeah, when I put my, thing? when I put mine in here, all that shows up is the, um, the additional augers that you gave me. Yeah, there's there's a large tank in here. I think it's. If you go into creative mode or into a different mode, it okay. deletes everything from them. I didn't go into creative, but uh, yeah, my fuel tank is. Yeah, there's a large there. one in there, so I'll have to make a lubricator one. For okay. Then it means you'll get that one. So. So what do yeah. I do with my shader? Then? Yeah, that that's weird because. Um, Even if you've gone into like spectator mode or something, does it? I matter? didn't. If you click on your shader, yeah. <laughs> yeah, thank you, thank you, Darby. And then you can um, put it back into here with your drill. There should be um, something on the right-hand side where you can put your shader bit, and then you take your drill out. What shader did you get? I got. Ooh, kind of I a bit like yours. One too. The Omni Tool one. Cool. Oh, what does that do? That's it just looks cool. That's yeah, cool. <laughs> it just makes it look better. It's I'm kinda... mechanical component. Should we have any of them? Ah, uh, there should be some in um, in the chest out here. At least one, I think. Let me see. No, I think I might have used them up. I'll make some quickly. Not that, not that hard to make. Uh, I though. shall make you one quickly. I can, I, I can sort it. I'm at this thing and they've got all the stuff I need over here. I think. Um, uh, we need some iron plates. Don't have any in storage. Yeah. Let me look over there. there. Oh, hang on. Iron plates got a load here. Is it just the one component that you need? Yeah, I just need one of those, please. Uh, let's try and make it properly. Putting things in the right place. Okay, I, think, I think you get a discount if you actually build those in this table over here, the workbench. What, the, uh, the actual machine? Bit? The iron mechanical components. I don't know where those yeah. iron plates disappeared. Let's build it in this one. Yeah, in the workbench. No, over here. I... Oh. Well, I've made one. The there. engineer's workbench. Oh, well, no matter. <laughs> right, where do you need the... Uh... Uh, I'm just over near the fine storage thing. Yeah, you might need the blueprint for them. But, uh... There you go. I have just thrown it to you. And I give this to the R. Mm -hmm. I was miles away from you then. I thought it was closer than mm -hmm. it was. So all the bits in it should give you the achievement when you take it out. There yep. we go. Okay. Yeah. That's <laughs> kind of funny, um, then, yeah. isn't it? Rare shader grab bag. Well, let me see what that one is. Sunstrike. Ooh. Yeah. There is another one in here I put in here just in case the uh, Lady Randoms didn't work. Okay, well, let me see so... what this one looks like. Ooh, Ooh I like Ooh. that. <laughs> okay. Do you want to open this one in here, Lady Random, or do you want to, do you want to open it? Uh, I'll put oh, yeah. that one in there in case you guys want it. What's this one look like then? <laughs> oh, oh, that looks, oh, that's an interesting set of colours. That's um. <laughs> what's, what's it called? It's called uh, Angel's Thesis. That looks a bit epic, I think. <laughs> Are you keeping that one? Uh, yes. <laughs> Check that out. Oh. <laughs> it's a bit like the Joker from Batman. 
yes. in yeah. drill form, and it's purple, and I like purple. So yeah, that's that's the one. That is that's the one. fine. Then we've all got something we like. I also <laughs> upgraded my uh, pistol. Um, you could with an extended <laughs> mag. <laughs> with an extended mag and there's something that shoots shocking bullets at enemies. They ain't shot any enemies yet. And then I got this one, which was a uh, Nuka Cola. I like it's called that. Called Sponsor. Well, it's night time now, and now you can try shooting some people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're all spawning uh, according to seven there. Right. Anyways, I did pull together the stuff for um, a few of the um, items that we're going to need for our train shop. So I made um, immersive engineering concrete. Perfect. To use up some of that slag. Um, I've made the uh, track blueprint, which is just some steel and some paper. Uh, I made the large wrench. That we need to put everything together with. And it's a very, very large wrench, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Go ahead and grab it and we'll show the people what it looks like. A large wrench. Let's go and show them a large wrench. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty big, yeah, isn't little... it? Yeah. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> yeah. The the middle row is everything for the um, the caster. And then uh, this, these three over here are for the rail press. Yeah. And then, and then this is for the steam hammer. There are two other machines that we'll need to make, or at least one. Uh, the uh, plate roller, and then if we want to do any type of steam engines, we'll also need the boiler roller. Awesome. I have to do a race between steam and diesel. Mm, I, from my understanding, that peppercorn uh, steam engine will get up and move it. It'll do like 100 miles an hour. It's a pretty nippy little huh. thing, isn't it? Yeah. Although the Firefly looks like it'd be a cute one, too. The Firefly, that's the, uh, was that Brunel's first engine or something like that, or one of his first engines? I, I, I don't know. But it's a really cool looking little engine. Mm. Um, and it's the book here that this kind of shows you a what the um, item is right now. It's what is this book set for? The plate machine. I think it's shift. It kind of works a little bit like the projector, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah. I just I'm um, trying to remember how you do it. Control. Yeah, I don't know how to change it to the different <laughs> machines i thought it was like shift click or something it might be it. the right might the center be. click might not like the um it might projector. be yeah like the old, old yeah. if we want to go hey. to like a big steampunky village then we yes. yeah so anyways um i think we're gonna hold off on building until the night's over i don't want to go out there right now no i think it's probably safer that we uh okay but we wanted to look at that, uh, what was that, the red bricks? Yes, the, uh, what, what is it called, red? Um... Red cobble, uh, red rock. Cobble. Red rock, that was it. Red and rock. They're so easy to make, they're really, really easy to make. Is it like red dye with cobble round it? Yeah. And I think in the system we've got hundreds of flowers. Uh, red okay, red it's uh, cobblestone with redstone. Ow. Cobblestone and redstone, yeah. Ow. With oh, redstone, we've got 690 blocks of redstone. Well, we might be alright for it then, mightn't we? Yeah. Oh, and um, I've just been... The stuff I've been mining, I turn it into blocks just to kind of save space in the system. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, since the system is actually physical, it's not like the drives or anything because we can't build yeah. those. Yeah, we, we have got enough because we've got all that space downstairs as well. I've sorted okay, out. So, so we have got a little bit of room. So red rock cobblestone. We were thinking about blue slate, weren't we, for the um, possibly the okay. roof, maybe. Oh, do we want to keep the water, Darby? Yeah. As it is, don't want to reshape it or anything like that. I was just setting fire to everything over there. 
Alright, let me get some of this red rock. I'm only setting fire to it because. 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 Because, okay. Because. Uh, that that might be enough for now. And do you just chisel this or do you have to cook it? Do you uh, want you just chisel it. Just chisel oh, okay. it. Oh, we've got uh, 740 yeah, the normal odd chisel. blocks of blue slate, so if we do yeah. want to do the blue slate roof, we can do that as well. Okay. Alright, so let me see. I think I've got the chisel in my back. Yeah. How, how are we going to build them, Mandari? Do you want big? Let's see uh, what kind I of... I don't know. <laughs> uh, I haven't really thought that far ahead. <laughs> Mm. Ow, 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 ow. 